the name of the alleged circle is not identified. You can imagine, Mr. Speaker, sir, distinguished senators, being called to defend yourself on a claim that you have taken over through your associates a circle that we don't know. Told now, come and defend yourself. I began by saying some of these claims are either ridiculous or embarrassing. Secondly, at paragraph 74A, you will be told that His Excellency has connived with the cartels in the tea sector to block the Kenya Tea Development Agency from implementing guaranteed minimum returns that would benefit tea farmers. No statement, no affidavit, no correspondence from any official of the Kenya Tea Development Agency is before you. No complaint to any agency, no complaint to this parliament by any official of the Kenya Tea Development Agency is before you. It's just a claim which the mover of this motion said before the National Assembly and surprisingly to those of us who have some residual faith in our institution, he told the National Assembly, just believe my word for what it is. And when we thought that was a joke, we got a joke lifted a notch higher. The National Assembly actually just believed his word for what it is. No evidence. Nothing in the affidavits before you addresses anything about the Kenya Tea Development Agency. Nothing in the five affidavits before you. Let's progress, good people. Paragraph 72 of the motion before you states that His Excellency has persistently undermined, demeaned, and committed insubordination instead of assisting the President. And let's face it, Mr. Speaker, sir, distinguished senators, if you accuse somebody of insubordination, the only person who can complain of being insubordinated is the supervisor. No statement from the president, no affidavit from the president, even no witness summons to the president has been sought here. To call him to complain, he has been insubordinated.